Well, this is a common problem up here in New England, a uh, foundation crack. They're usually caused by some settling of the house on the foundation or the ground beneath it. But, you know, a crack like this, we got to take care of because this is an entry point for water. Above ground, it could be an entry point for cold air in the winter. Now, we're going to work on this side of the crack on the outside today, and at some point I will also have to have the inside of the crack taken care of. But just let's take care of this one today. Now, what we have to do is we're going to use a special kind of cement, and that's hydraulic cement. And what makes hydraulic cement so special, it's the only kind of cement that actually expands as it dries. Most cements, in fact, almost all other cements, will contract slightly as it dries. So this is special for that, plus this kind of cement will also stop running water. So let's say down in the cellar, I had water coming in below grade into the cellar floor. I can mix this material up, pack it into that hole, and it'll stop the water from, from coming in. I don't have to wait for a dry day. So to get started with, we're going to do a little bit of chiseling out here in the crack because hydraulic cement doesn't stick to old cement. It more works like the filling in your teeth. Where the doctor makes an inverted Y, something to hold that filling in place. Well, the same thing with hydraulic cement. So we got a little bit of prep work to do of, of chipping this out. Then I'm going to mix up my cement and we'll get it all packed into that hole. Hydraulic cement has a very short workability life. I mean, we're talking five, maybe 10 minutes. So I never really want to mix too much and any one time. I want to get this to the consistency of like a clay type material. Because what I'm actually going to do is, is pick it up with my hands, make it into small little balls, and then force it down into those, those little cracks. Or I could use, I suppose I could just use my trowel tool. My cracks here are pretty big. So I've got it in a nice consistency. force it right down into that hole. Put a little bit more on the bottom of my trowel here. And that looks good. Now I will tell you that hydraulic cements are your darker in color. So if you're trying to match the foundation, you may have to go back over it with another kind of a concrete finish later on, but that'll expand inside that groove, hold itself in there, stop the water from coming in, and now you'll have a nice secure foundation. 